Hi, my name is Saurav. I'm currently pursuing full stack web development course at Atayi. I'm here to present Petfinder as my project. So what is Petfinder? Petfinder is an online pet adaptation platform where users can list pet animals with their location, search and view the listed pets, request to adopt the pets and like the pets. Reason to choose this project is to solve the realistic problem as there are lack of such platforms available for our country. Features were practically attainable and overall idea was fun and interesting to work on. That's why we chose to work on this project. So let's get what technology we have used. We have used Bootstrap and CSS for UI development, Node.js for the runtime environment, Express as a framework to work upon Node.js. To store our data, we have used MongoDB. To store multimedia files, we have used Cloudinary. And for the deployment of our project, we have used Heroku. Let's quickly get a look. So this is the landing page of Petfinder. You can see various nav links, dog, cat, trick, dog, login and sign up button. And this is the search bar where user can search the pet according to their location. These are the pets added by the various users. We have used bootstrap card to get the list of these pets this is the footer of our pets the first step is to sign up click on sign up it will redirect you to the sign up form enter the details enter email Username. Username should be unique. We have used MD5 to encrypt the password. Password should be minimum 8 characters. Click on submit. After submitting, it will redirect you to the login page. Let's log in here. As you can see, I have successfully logged in. You can see the logout button here. Now quickly check user profile. So these are the details we have added. Swayam Raj as our user username. This is the email ID. You can also edit this detail. Click on edit and update. You can see information updated successfully. You can see all the changes here. We can also change the background image, click on upload, choose file, click on update. As you can see, background image is changed now. These are the two sections uploaded pets and live pets where user can see the pets uploaded by him and the pets liked by him so let's quickly add a pet click on this button called add pet button it will redirect you to the 
form enter the details pet name age you can choose whether the pet is vaccinated or not if it is vaccinated click on yes trend category in our case this dog click on dog select breed location enter the location we have used google maps to get the location as in suggestion color enter the email contact number short description we have to upload the image also click on choose file Click on add. We have used Tini5 PNG to compress the size of image. As you can see, Smith is added here under the uploaded pen section. <coughs> now let's quickly check whether it is appeared in the doc section or not. As we have mentioned the category as dog, you can see here Smith is under dog category. We can also search pets according to the breed. Click on this breed, go to the dog breed. As we have added Smith as a pub, we can search it by pub. Click on search. It will display all the bugs available to adopt. So you can see Simba and Smith are the two bugs which are available for the adoption. To get more details about this myth, click on details. You will get all the details about Smith, the category, dog category, breed, which is pub, age, one year, color, location, whether it is vaccinated or not. On clicking cats, we have redirected to the cats route where all the cats which are listed by users available here. We can also see the request for our pets. As we don't have any request now, we are getting this message. You don't have any request for the adoption. So let's quickly make an request and check. Thank 
as we have added form we are going to request for that click on move info button <coughs> Click on the add off button. You can see the message here. You cannot cancel add off request after confirming this. Click on OK. Request is sent successfully. We can also like it click on this hard button so let's see whether the request appears or not let's quickly check Click on this request. As I requested from another account, you can see under the request section, I have received a request from this person. And these are the details of that person who is requesting to adopt this pet. If I want to accept this request, I can accept that. If I want to delete, I can delete the request. So let's accept the request. Click on accept. Click on OK. So the request is adopted successfully. And you can see. here that smith is adopted under the adopted section so this is the whole idea of our project we are also trying to implement the future improvements like uh, login with the social media account, real-time notification, search bar, social sharing widgets. Thanks for watching. Thank you.